Hey there, horror fans. Today I've got a tale for you that's as spine-chilling as it is side-splitting. Picture this. Deep in the heart of Bigfoot's kingdom, a place where the trees are taller than your average skyscraper and the air is thick with mystery. So, our story kicks off with a boy named Timmy. Timmy, bless his soul, believed he was destined to be the king of this enchanted forest. I mean, sure, why not aim high, right? Timmy would parade around the woods with a makeshift crown proclaiming himself as the ruler of all Bigfoots. The Bigfoots, of course, just rolled their eyes. They had bigger things to worry about, like finding enough berries to keep their fur glossy. But then, enter our next character, Agatha. Ah, Agatha, the woman everyone swore was a witch. She lived in a crooked little hut on the edge of the forest and had a knack for brewing potions that smelled like a mix of old socks and marshmallows. Timmy, being the aspiring king, decided he needed her on his side. You know, every good king needs a royal witch. Or so he thought. One foggy night, Timmy marched up to Agatha's hut. Agatha, I need your help to become the king of the Bigfoots. She stared at him, probably wondering if he had hit his head on one of those tall trees. Kid, do you even know what you're asking for? She cackled. These Bigfoots don't need a king, they need a brain. But Timmy, being the persistent little king wannabe, wouldn't back down. Agatha finally agreed, but on one condition. Timmy had to fetch her a rare mushroom from the deepest part of the forest. The catch? The mushroom was guarded by the crankiest Bigfoot of them all, old Grumblefoot. You can guess how that went. Timmy, armed with nothing but his crown and sheer determination, ventured into the depths. It didn't take long before old Grumblefoot spotted him. With a roar that probably echoed all the way to the nearest Starbucks, Grumblefoot chased Timmy out of the forest, crown and all. Back at Agatha's hut, Timmy, now a bit wiser and a lot more scared of Bigfoots, realised maybe being king wasn't all it was cracked up to be. Agatha, sipping her marshmallow-scented potion, just laughed. So, next time you dream of ruling over Bigfoot's kingdom, remember Timmy's tale. Sometimes it's best to leave the crown at home. Thanks for tuning in, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more hilarious horror tales.